Once upon a time, there was a race across the waves with several Irish chieftains competing for the same prize, Ulster. According to the rules of the race, the first man to place his hand on the province of Ulster would have claim to it. When our Devony ancestor saw that he was on the brink of losing the race, he chopped off his hand and threw it over his competitors. The bloody hand landed on the beach and our ancestor won the race. You could only imagine my surprise when, years later, remembering what my dad had told me, I googled the Red Hand of Ulster and found out that his harrowing homage to hand hacking was in fact a well-established Irish legend. In other versions of the legend, of course, other warriors perform the self-mutilating feat and pull off the upset win. Sometimes it's an O'Neill, sometimes it's Neil of the Nine Hostages, the quasi-historical high king and progenitor of the O'Neill dynasty, while in other versions it's Eremon, son of Milispana, leader of the Milesians, i.e. Gaelic-speaking Celts from Spain and forerunners to Ireland modern